Can I help you, Edward? Yeah, I'm here for the early bird special. Are those new slacks? What's that now? Are those new slacks? I got these on special at Caldor. Who drove you there? My nephew. Ah, oh, that was nice of him. I forgot why I came over. Are those new slacks? Sorry to intrude. I just wanted to let myself into your private residence. Huh. Nobody's home. Nobody's home? Principal party! Now, when I was a young boy, at the age of five, my mother's child gonna be the greatest man in life. Put this on. Why? Because I'm skipping my physical to go have steaks with the guys, and I don't want Lois to know about it. Um, okay. Lois, I'm going to my physical now. Okay, honey, I'll see you later. Um, what, what the hell, I'll just ask it. Why do we need the horse suit for that? What? The female power to belittle is such that the recipient can physically shrink in stature. That's why husbands and wives are the same height in old age. Lois, berate me. Okay, Peter, but if I do this, I really gotta do it. Do it. For starters, you're a failure. Ah! You didn't go to college, Daddy pays our mortgage, and you're a terrible husband and father. Ouch! Your whole life is a pattern of hateable noises. Oh. The way you chew a banana makes it sound like it's filled with bones. Ouch! I loathe the little wheeze at the crest of every breath you take. Yikes! I hate the one story you tell at every cocktail party about almost meeting John Kerry. That's a good story! You didn't even meet him! Almost. Your eyeglass lenses have been smudged for 19 years. Ah, crap. Everyone hates it when you see fireworks and you announce, this is a finale. Please stop. Pink Floyd is multiple guys. He is? You're so predictable. I know every word that's going to come out of your mouth before you even say it. Balderdash. Heavens. Heavens. Stop, stop that. that. I, I worked for Pure Later Courier, Courier before, before they, they went, went bankrupt. bankrupt. Appearance. <laughs> Intelligence. <laughs> Penis size. <laughs> Thing. Well, Lois, you are a master. Hey, guys, let's play a party game. Let's go stand over near Brian, and we'll take a drink every time he says bonerific. Bonerific? Yeah, it's his catchphrase. He says it all the time. Yeah, sure, okay. I'm here. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> hey, hey, Brian, how are you feeling tonight? Good. Having a nice time. Are you feeling terrific, or any variation on that word? Oh, sure. No complaints. My skin's a little dry. He's not saying it, Peter. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, why would I say that? It's not even a word. What isn't a word? Bonerific. Ah! Did I tell you? You can't keep this guy from saying it. Lois, can I please see you in Joe's kitchen? Don't you mean our kitchen? No, they have better snacks. So, Meg's boyfriend. Interesting choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I know Joe has Cheez-Its. I saw him eating them earlier. Where the hell are they? You're not gonna find them. I was eating a bunch of them, and I jokingly said, Bonnie, hide these. And she did. She hides my food so I don't get bored like a zoo polar bear. Good luck. They could be anywhere. We'll do a show for people with no attention span. We'll call it the Six Second Talk Show. Well, I guess that could work. All right, Six Second Talk Show in three, two. I'm Peter Griffin, and this is the Six Second Talk Show. My guest tonight is Joe Biden. And that's all the time we have. Thanks for watching. Good night. How was that? Yeah, it kind of dragged. Well, Congress is at it again. Good night. It's the Six Second Talk Show. And now, your host, here. Welcome to the Six Second Talk Show. I'm Peter Griffin, and now our musical guest, Bare Naked Ladies. Get spent. I'd like to thank our musical guest, Bare Naked Ladies. Good night. Ah, ah, ah. Look, look, do you like it? Yes. What do you like about it specifically? I don't know. Pick something or I'll blow your brains out. I like how it looks like an owl. Thank you for the compliment. <laughs> hey, Peter, you want to earn another ten bucks? Of course I do. Great, I got a hilarious one. 
I'll give you $10 for your L4 vertebrae. So, uh, I guess this means, Peter, you're our Joe now, and Joe, you're our Peter. That means you gotta do anything for 10 bucks. Okay. I have a request. Yay, Joe's chin! Ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done. I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. I work at Burger King making flame boy whoppers. I wear paper hats. Would you like an apple pie with that? Would you like an apple pie with that? Ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done, ding, fries it done. I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. Don't touch the fries in hot fat, it really hurts bad, and so do skin grafts. Would you like an apple pie with that? Would you like an apple pie with that? Wait for the bell, can't hear the bell. Where is the bell? Wait for the bell. Ding, fries are done. Ding, fries are done. All right, guess who just wrote 10 facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? Is one that he's Jewish? Guess who just wrote nine facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? He likes classic cars. Guess who just wrote eight facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? You probably said he was Jewish a second time. All right, new article. One fact you didn't know about Michael Richards. You can't use that word in an article. And I will find a new show to write about. Oh, this is great! I feel so alive! Come on, ladies, kick your high heels off and get moving! You guys are a disgrace! Peter, this doesn't seem safe. Yeah, I'm afraid I might. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Thanks, Spider-Man. Everybody gets one. Tell him, Peter. Uh, apparently everybody gets one. Bingo. There it is. Warm cuts. Like cold cuts, but warm. A million dollar idea. Warm cuts? That's dumb. If it's so dumb, how come we're pitching it on Shark Tank? Now, when we first started warm cuts, it was just a gross idea. But this year, we're on track to get sued for twelve and a half million dollars. That's quadruple the projections. You know what? I like your product, but more than that, I like you guys. I'm in, and I'll give you exactly what you're asking for. $100,000 for 10%. What do you say? Does anyone other than Robert have an offer? Well, I fixed the power line, but the town zoning laws prohibit building a pool back there. What are you talking about? It's my yard. I'm sorry, but your house is too close to the curb. Oh, yeah? Well, your eyes are too close to your nose. Well, that may be, but you know what? I only have to wear one goggle when I go swimming in my pool. Hey, wait, 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 come back here. What? I have to draw you. You're why cavemen painted on walls. Sucks that we're stuck here alone. Wait a minute. Here alone? You thinking what I'm thinking? This was not what I was thinking. That's weird. It's not what I was thinking either. I don't even know how it happened. No, me neither. But this spaghetti's not half bad. A happy mistake, we'll call it. Is a glorious afternoon. Wouldst thou not agree? Uh, 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 yea, kind shrew. Uh, I before thee, except after she. Enjoy your soup, old man whose butt is out. <gasps> you! <coughs> Jeez, what's wrong with you? We usually start fighting. I'm dying, Peter. Oh. Let me close your privacy curtains to make you more comfortable. <laughs> that feel better? I'm sweating more than a non-legacy applying to Yale. <laughs> Hello? Oh, hey, Quagmire. What's up? Hey, Peter, I need some help with my computer. I can't find my photos. Did you look under photos? What is that? It's a folder called photos. Yeah, I, I don't have that. I just have 40 folders all called new folder. Okay, you know what? Click on your hard drive. Okay, now, now the arrow on the screen, that's me, right? Yeah, yeah, that's you. Okay, now, now, now just... Whoa, 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 there's a calculator on this thing? <sighs> Listen, Quagmire, what are you trying to do? I just want to put pictures of my cat on everyone's internet computer. Like, how do I do that? Okay, wait, there's an agreement that just popped up. H hang on, let, let me read the whole thing. Just hit accept. 
Well, that seems a little foolhardy, doesn't it, Peter? Look, do we have to do this now? I'm watching something. I know, I'm sorry. I I'm just nervous that somebody else is gonna get pictures of their cat on the internet first, and then I'll always be known as the second guy to get pictures of his cat on the internet. Quagmire, I don't know how to tell you this, but there's already cats on the internet. Wait, it's, it's giving me that pinwheel thing. It, it, it's frozen. It, uh, oh my god, oh my god, it crashed! The whole thing just crashed! Jeez, Quagmire, calm down, we'll figure it out. No, Peter, the whole thing's fried! I can't even- Ah! Oh, damn it! What the hell? Hey, you clicked accept. And I got a job following fat people around with a tuba. Stop it! Cut it out! I have a glandular problem! That'll be $60. Peter, I don't think I can have you in the house right now. You're throwing me away? Yes. I'm so sorry, Peter. I just feel like if you don't kindle joy, and that's what the book said... You can't kick me out of my own house. The house that I pay for, that I semi-pay for with help from your parents, that your parents pay for entirely, but I get to put the mortgage coupon in the mailbox? That your parents pay for entirely using auto draft from their account while I put a pretend mortgage coupon that clearly says not legal tender into the mailbox? That your parents pay for entirely using auto draft from their account while I put a pretend mortgage coupon that says not legal tender into Stewie's Sesame Street mailbox? That your parents pay for entirely using auto draft from their account while Chris puts a pretend mortgage coupon that says not legal tender into Stewie's Sesame Street mailbox while I hold the plastic door open for them? That your parents pay for entirely. Yeah, we get it. Okay. What's happening again? I'm asking you to leave the house. The house that I pay for? Mmm, delicious. I will seriously consider purchasing this product. Oh, what have we here? May I partake? Mmm. Oh, sausage son. Plan to buy great amount for samurai buddies. Sir, you don't have to keep moving to the back of the line. You can have as many as you want. They're free. What are you talking about? Hey, can I have some more sausage? Yeah, me too. I don't know, Peter. That'd be pretty tough to pull off. We just gotta be bold. Like those backwards knee birds. Oh, what? What? Oh, what? What? What are you looking at? Oh, you coming for me? Nope. Nope. I'll just take a big backward knee step in the opposite direction. Yeah. Yeah, you think I'm afraid of you? I slept on your back last night, you If you think you're coming any closer, you're as mistaken as a thinking seagull. <laughs> okay, the fishing boats will be in soon. We'll fly behind them and scream like hell, and whatever they throw overboard, we get to eat. Um, you think maybe we should just get our own food? I mean, you know, we, we have beaks, we can swim. Instead of scrounging off of others, maybe can we... I, can, I, can I see you for a minute? What was that? What was that? Oh, you you, you want to be a hawk? No. Is that what you want? Because you're not. No. All right, you see any clutching talons down there? No, we I have know. webbed feet. I know. Well, I what know. are you going to do, paddle your food to death? Oh. You're going to find a little field mouse and paddle him to death with your webbed feet? No. Look, I just thought... You thought? You thought? How's that working out for you? Not very well. Not very well. I do not want to have this discussion again.